seen other blood still work. Y'all see
uh, before you bring you the welcoming of and the occasion uh, for today. Oh, I right. um, we welcome you Amen. to this wonderful service. Amen. We welcome you, and I'm out of breath. <laughs> all right, that's all right. That means I'm blessed. To celebrate, to celebrate oh, the ministry, 40 years ministry of Pastor Quentin. Amen. Amen. Done. You just took your shoes off to get yes, yes. off. Yes. Praise the Lord. So get comfortable and get ready. Amen. 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 So the man, the music, the ministry. Mm -hmm. So as a church, we want to thank you for what he has done for us. We praise and glorify God always. And his love endures forever. Amen. We're gathered here today to give honor and glory to God. His mercies are everlasting. And what a joy to mark a special event and our pastor's life. Amen. Amen. We're celebrating our pastor who has been serving our church for the past six years, but serving the Father and spreading the gospel for 40 years. Right. 40, years. 40 years of faithful service has been a generous gift uh, to a world that is in need. Yes. May the Lord bless you as you have blessed so many and give you peace and joy in your priestly service. Romans 15 and 13 says, May the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace. So we thank God for allowing Pastor Burnett to come and serve in our church thank and you, for the Lord. opportunity to be ministered to always. That's right. So the prophet Jeremiah, through the inspiration of the Holy Spirit, prophesied and said, God knew us <coughs> even before we were born yeah. and set us aside to use us in advance for his purposes yes. on the earth. So you are living, you are living your purpose, Pastor Burnett, Amen. right now. Glory to God. And we thank God. For you. Yeah. Amen. So Pastor Bernie, as you remember the way the Lord has used you, we cannot stop praising God. Yes. We want to remember the great things he has spoken to us through you. Yes. The great sermons that we listen to every Sabbath, your words of encouragement all the time. Yes. And there are times when you need encouragement. Yes. Even then, you show us how to look to the Lord for encouragement. I know. Yes. 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 We Lord bless God, God for your caring heart and your love that you have shown us um, to your, you know, your people. Yes. So we want to dedicate this day to remember you because you accept it to be used by our Almighty Father. Yes. As we keep on calling upon his name, yes. this day, we want to say that we love you, yes. we thank God for you, and may the Lord continue to show you favor. Yes. And it's gonna be my fault. <laughs> so, yes. buckle up. so in Daniel uh, 12, thir uh, three says, those who are wise will shine like the brightness of the heavens, and those who lead many to righteousness like the stars forever and ever. Keep letting your light shine and continue to be receptive to the voice of the Lord to pour into the people. So we thank you for your ministry. We thank you for your guidance. We thank you for your service. And we are grateful that you are here with us. We appreciate the good work you're doing. And it is our sincere prayer unto God that he may keep you always. You may live to inspire many. May you empower many. And may your work spread far and wide. And we praise the Lord for you always. Now to the music part of the man. God will take our efforts, talents, and abilities and multiply them and use them as God chooses. Our part of God's human equation is to offer God what we have. We are not in charge of changing lives, drawing people closer to God, or creating Holy Spirit moments. These are God's to do. Give what you have to offer to God and God can be trusted to do his part. The gift that was given to you, worship through music. Uh, you've taught many of us the importance of worship and worshiping God through music. We've learned from what we've learned from you that when we worship, we're engaging with God. We are doing on earth what we will spend an eternity doing in the presence of God. While worship is a rehearsal for heaven, it is more important than that. It is a connection, an extension of heaven. We encounter God in places that may be between here and eternity. We worship on earth with our earthly community. Yet, we are connected to God in an internal act of offering towards God. Service through worship ministry is a high calling. Nothing can be more important. As we consider the Mary Martha story, it is easy to argue that the practical or the holy things of the church are more important. However, sitting at Jesus' feet is important and preparing for the work of worship is important. We appreciate the valuable teachings that you give to us as we learn new songs and the meaning of each verse. Thank you for not making worship about music, but for teaching us what it means Amen. to worship Amen. 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 Thank you for taking the time each week to prayerfully select songs 
that you believe your church to sing together. Yes. Thank you for spending time each week to practice the songs on your own and then with the worship team. Thank you for keeping a high standard, not just musically, but spiritually, so that we as a church are giving God our very best. Amen. Thank you for not making it about you, but always making it about God. Amen. And lastly, thank, take courage. Lead with confidence, not in yourself or your abilities, but in Christ who gives you strength. I love you, we love you, and may the Father continue to show you favor. Thank you.
for this uh, for this day and for this occasion. Amen. Amen. Uh, Reverend Tennyson is a Dallas native that grew up in the church and accepted Christ as his personal savior at the age of eight. Amen. He began working at the early age of nine by pumping gas and washing cars at a local car wash and gas station so that he could ease the financial burden that followed his grandmother's death. Reverend, Reverend Tennyson is a graduate of H. Grady Spruce High School, yeah. Southern Bible Institute, <laughs> and Prayer Review A&M University, right. where he received a bachelor's degree in general communication. Right. Yeah. Reverend Tennyson accepted God's call upon his life to preach his word and preach his first sermon, and preached his first sermon on September 17, 2000, and was ordained the following year on September 18, 2001. He was a member of Sweet Home Missionary Baptist Church for 25 years under the leadership of Pastor W.L. Johnson and served as an associate minister. Other Christian experience includes serving as an executive deacon, Sunday school teacher, trustee, and treasurer. On September 9, 2007, the members of Pleasant Hill Missionary Baptist Church elected and invited Reverend Tennyson to become their senior pastor. Yeah. Reverend Lord Tennyson is married to Mary P. Tennyson, and they have three children, Amen. Nicholas, Adam, and Kanani. Amen. So I introduce the song and present to us all Pastor Kenan Tennyson. Right. As we celebrate this man of God. Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah. 
Glory to your name. I was nine years old when he shot me. Yeah. Let me tell you. I was a boy. Put him in the ass at the gas station. They called him. We wasn't even thought of him. Some of y'all wasn't even thought of him. Yeah. Amen. Can we say amen? Yes. I don't care about him telling his age. Some of y'all didn't get here about 10 years after you preached. Yeah. Uh. But look at this, y'all. Really, I'm almost through preaching. You, you, you can't. I'm almost through. I think I got about two more hours with me. <laughs> I want to read you a passage of scripture that that, that, that I think that I think is going to encourage my friend. But as it is written, I has not seen. Come on. Come on. Come on. Right here. That's the verse. Right there. Q neither has it entered. The heart of me. Yeah. Heart of me. Right. The things which God has prepared for them. Love. Yes. Let's read verse 10. But God has yeah. revealed them yeah. unto us yeah. by his spirit. By his spirit. For the Spirit searches all things, mm. the deep things of God. Yes, sir. That's his word. For what man knows the things of a man, save the spirit of a man, which is in him. Even so the things of God knows no man, but the spirit of God. I want to talk about the best is yet to come. Amen. 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 preach, Pastor. Best is yet to come. Is yet to come. How can you say that? Because Paul is pulling this passage of scripture, uh, referring back to Isaiah 64 and 4. Yeah. All right. When Isaiah said the same thing to a group of captive people when Israel yeah. was held captive. Yeah. That eyes have not seen, ears have not heard, neither has it in the hearts of man the good things that God has in store for them who love the Lord and call according to his purpose. Yeah. Yeah. But what, 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 what Paul is saying here in 1 Corinthians is that now that the Spirit has come, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we're no longer bound. We've been set free. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and I was looking at this far and flew with, excuse me, Marcus, and, 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 and 40 years, and I looked up the word 40 years, Moses was on the backside of the mountain for 40 years. You know, Moses was 120 years old before he really got things going, right? right. He spent 40 years in the palace, 40 years on the backside of the mountain, and 40 yeah, years in the wilderness. you're right. 40 years. What does that mean? It says 40 re years represents the time it takes, Q, for a new generation to arrive. Right. Mm. And you've been grinding for 40 years. And if you look around, Pastor Burnett, a new generation has been given. Because it takes new people to keep the word moving. See, 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 then I, I'm looking at this, I'm like, okay, well, wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. They talk about the man, the musician, and the ministry. This is a good man. Yeah. Let me say it again. He's a good man. What makes him good? Not that he's perfect, but he's a godly man. That's right. If this man makes sure his family is taken care of. This man works hours that I can even see. I don't see how he do it. But he never complained. Yeah. That this man that God called when he was in his youth doing probably the same thing we were doing in our youth. Yeah. Couldn't believe that God would call him at that time. You know what I'm saying? Right. See, see y'all don't understand the, 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 the work that comes with or, or the pressure behind being called to preach the gospel. Yeah. See, see, you look from your point of view, see, you ain't never been on this right. You're only speculating help us, help what us. you think it is, yeah. how it should be, the way you think it should be, how he ain't supposed to do nothing wrong. I'm here to tell you, he probably mess up on anybody in the room. Yeah. Right. Amen. And we use him because it's for the years. Yeah. <laughs> he ain't perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But his heart is pure. Yeah. That's it. That's it. He answered the call. Oh. Amen. Don't, don't you hate when somebody call you and never, and they don't answer? Yeah. Can't you tell when they send you the voicemail? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, y'all don't like y'all ain't never sent yeah. nobody the yeah. voicemail. And don't that bother you when you oh, call yeah. somebody and they send you the voicemail? Yeah. Like you just, they are too busy. Yeah. Yeah. Can you imagine what, 
would have happened if he got too busy well, come on. to hear the call of God? Right. It can, can you imagine what this world would be like if he had not accepted it? As a matter of fact, we wouldn't even be here had he not accepted the call. Right. The call was so much earlier before he became a pastor. All right. The musician loves God. I can't stand him in that area either. Man, I had a thought coming to church. I'm going to play this little melody, okay, 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 okay. Yeah, too, you can play it. And I want you to sing the last verse. <laughs> How is it ever time you and God talk? <laughs> I got to be. Yeah. I was sweet. You had just got out to 530. But <laughs> time he, uh, he had to sing the song, uh, and it took me a long time to get dressed. So he just sang it. I know he's going to be there in a minute. I know he's going to be there in a minute. I know he's going to be there in a minute. And it took a little longer, so he kept saying the same old verse. Then I walked out, amen, he's here. Because he said the, 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 the method is not going to be complete without you being a part of it. Because that's what God showed me. I'm going somewhere with this. The ministry. Which led me to this passage. Mm -hmm. All right. He is so sincere All right. about ministry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Pastor, I'm here for whatever you need me to do, I'm here. You call me over to help you, I'm here to help you. We 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 have come here to do nothing but lift up the name of Jesus. Yeah. Are you with me? All right. Let me All right. go to the beginning. Look, 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 look. I, I, I look at it, I say, this sounds like you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I, brother, number one, when I came to you, came not with excellence of speech or of wisdom. I, I, didn't, I didn't come acting like I knew it all. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, I got some education, but I didn't even come to display my education. I, I came meek and low and humble. Listen, 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 listen. Declaring unto you the testimony of God, which is Christ in him crucified. See, 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 that's all this is about. Christ and him being crucified. Yeah. All right. Because when you don't know Christ, you are in bondage. Yeah, 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 yeah. When you know Christ, you've been set free. Now, anybody want to be free? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so what, 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 what happened 40 years ago was a calling for him to tell the good news of All right. Christ. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To set the captives free. Amen. To mend the broken Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. To give sight to the wow. and help the lame man. Wow. Yes, sir. Yeah. 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 Two years. Yeah. And, and, and sometimes, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm telling you. Uh, 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 for I determined not to know anything yeah. among you. Right there. All right. Save Christ, mm -hmm. save Jesus Christ, right. in Him. I don't know nothing. I don't know nothing. Right. That's all I think. Yeah. Can you imagine what ministry would be like when that's all you know? My, my, my. Not who can lead the best song. Yeah. Come on, right. come on. Not who can coordinate the suits and not who's sitting and doing the wrong. Save Jesus Christ in him. That's all I know. Because what is all you know? Because that's what saved me. Thank you, man. Say Jesus Christ, yeah, no. I, I don't know. Yeah, now, amen. Now, and, 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 and the reason why I call it what a reclaim is because Paul said he killed himself. Sometimes it can be very discouraging amen. to tell the truth and don't see no results. Amen. Come on now. Have you ever told the truth? Got to hope it anyway? Yeah. 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 Mama say, even if you're wrong, tell the truth. Yeah. I'm still going to whoop you. But tell the truth. And why do you tell the truth? What are we going to get a one thing? Listen, watch, watch out. I'm going to whoop my son. And I'm going to get him. I'm going to get him. Who I'm going to get him. I'm going to get him. I walk past the door. He told the truth. He liked to be told the truth. I'm still going to get him. I walk past the door. He said, Father God, please. <laughs> 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 Father God, please, in the name of Jesus, I, I know I was wrong. I told the truth. 
touch my dad as much as he don't whoop me in Jesus' name and pray, amen. amen. What do you do with that? Because I went to the dog cave with the bell in my hand. He wouldn't let you do it. I'm, yes. I told him, I said, yeah. son, you ought to go on shopping. Why let me you? Yes. I heard your prayer. I, I heard you praying and asking God to not let you get for real. Yeah. I'm going to show you how bad I was. Yeah. I'm going to drop the bell on the bed and walk oh, away. <laughs> Save the 
got saved. Not to sing a song, not to throw our weight around, not to have a title. God saves us so we can set others free. You wonder why he, 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 he delivers you from being a crackhead? Because there's some crackheads that need to know. You know why he delivers you from the streets of our prostitution? Because there's still some prostitutes that God needs to hurt You know why you come from that uh, abusive relationship? You know why you've been molested now and set free? Because people that have been abused, people that have been molested, don't feel like they're grinding. But when you look at you and you tell people, Me 
Tell my friend, he don't know what to do with 40 years somebody celebrating him. Yeah. See, you always celebrating people, Bob. Yeah. You gotta learn how to be celebrated. Yeah. See, because when you learn to be celebrated, you can keep celebrating. Yeah. And when God puts us in your spirit to do something for you, I'm telling you it's because I had to learn it. Yeah. When God touches people's hearts, yeah. roll with it. Yeah. Yeah. Because God knows what you need. need. Yeah. Take me to the next yeah. level. Yeah. Because watch this. Uh, he gives seed to the soul. So here they are ready to sow seeds into you and you're blocking it. See, because when you accept the seeds that they're sowing, they get more seeds to. And who is they shepherd? So now you're elevated to your level because you're letting the people be led by the Spirit and do what only God tells them to. That's why, that's why it wasn't hard for these guys to show up because it was a spirit move. All right, all right. And that's why, that's why I'm not going to a funeral. They asked me to preach it. I told them I'll let the other preacher preach it. They didn't know this program was going to take place. But God knew this was going to take place. Right. So, so because, yes, I need him to preach, yeah. I let him decrease and tell him to preach. Yeah. So now when I get over there, all I got to do is read the program on fire. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can I say go to my level? Can I say the best yet to come? Yeah. They gave me 20 minutes anyway. Mm. Oh, okay. <laughs> right. He back. Mm. Mm. Well, here's the deal. Yeah. I only need 20 minutes. All right. Yeah. I'm going to my friend. Yeah. 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 At the dead, bury the dead. We're on a battlefield. Yeah. 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 The wisdom that comes from salvation is only given from God. Yeah, 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 he yeah. won't let nobody, just anybody see this. Yeah, so that's yeah. why he said, everybody said they know me, don't know me, because I have not revealed myself to them. This wisdom of impartation of the Spirit and being baptized only comes from God. Yeah, yeah. And faith come by yeah. and hearing by the word of God. How can they hear without a preacher? How can they preach yourself to be? See, God sends the preacher to develop your faith. All right. Because without faith, it's impossible to please. Come on now, Bridget. Come. Yes, sir. Listen, man, I'm so excited. Hallelujah. I, 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 I wake up every morning. And anticipating a move in the All right. All right. Now, I've been working on a car yesterday. I'm, I'm, talking, I'm talking about how bad God is. Yeah. I went and bought a light bulb, and the light had light bulbs in it. Come on. I said, I just wasted my money. But when I cut the lights on, the other light was blown out. Y'all missed it. I thought I was buying a light from one side. But I didn't know I needed it for the light. Nobody bug out. Freaks, man. Say real slow. Real slow. I bought a light bulb. Like I needed it on one side. Not paying attention that the new light had two bugs in it. All right. All right. Come on, Come on now. I was finna take it back to get my money back. The Lord said, you need it. I checked the fuses, all of them were good. He said, check the light. Come on now. Well, the light was working this morning. Come on, check the light. It was wrong. I bought the light for one thing. Yeah. Yeah. Not knowing. 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 Yeah. 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 I'm fine about you. Yeah. 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 Amen. Right. 
Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Right, One of the most humblest men I know. Yes, yeah. 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 Y'all yeah. yeah. don't know. I know. Y'all make me know God really. I mean, you, you, think, about, think about this. Can we go? Y'all ain't used to know Sunday morning preaching. And when y'all went to church, you ain't like them. All right. Come on, man. 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 Can we just run the truth? Run it. Let me tell you something. I ain't no Sunday morning preacher. I'm a God's preacher. No matter, it's a day. Don't we talk about him. You're supposed to talk about him without ceasing. Amen. Come on, y'all. Don't get hung up on religion. Right. 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 I said, my girl, I sit in there on the side of the truth. You hear me? Yeah, we do. I'm just talking about, let me see what he's talking about. His Bible says stuff. He's ain't running like mine. He said, he's like I said. He said, he's hungry. Right. Right.
Okay, let's dance. Look. How do you know? And I'm gonna take my shit. Because yeah. I serve a God. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Two. Yes. Two sardines. Say, yeah. Tell it. Two, two little sardines and yeah. five. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 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 Come on. Five thousand men by yeah. myself. Oh, so. yeah. Yeah. Just be sure. Uh -huh. It's about 15,000 people in all. See, you don't even know the shot. Let's be sure. Come out, he's better. Come out, come out, come out. He said, Yo, Dad, disciples, pick up the practice. Yo, Dad, church members, you don't think the church is going to work? Pick up the practice. And I'm going to get 12 boxes. But each one of you that died with me, you may have some new problems, but that won't be there no more. Because my grace.
June 1st, 2019. <laughs> 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 This one last one is from the Hearns. They sent this from St. Louis, Missouri. Yeah. Ah! Yeah. 
God, give them courage. Give them the faith to walk on water, Father God. God, we just thank you for increasing us in your kingdom. Increasing us in understanding. Increasing us in love, Father God, to love one another. 